We've got Patreon. Finally. It's so long overdue. And we finally got it. We need you to sign up. Do it. Do it. <laughs> For as little as £3 a month, you're going to get 48 hours early access to public episodes. And you're going to get a Patreon exclusive episode every Thursday. We're going to do specials. We're going to do loads. But it all depends on the support we get. So the more of you that sign up, the more content we're going to put out. Get involved. We've been asked for ages and now we're in a position where we can finally do it and we're dead excited. Sign up so we can get rid of Liam's jacket. We'll get him a better one. It's awful, isn't it? It's so I bad. I like the jacket. <laughs> it's so bad. You ah. sign up, we'll get him another one. And <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Give us three pound a month so Liam can have decent clobber. Yeah. <laughs> it says a lot about you. Sign up, do it. We'd really appreciate the support. Links in the description, all that good stuff. You know where to find it. So, Dan, you live in Liverpool, right? Yeah, I do. Yeah. How long have you been in Liverpool for? Like five years. Five years? Yeah, have you really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And clinging on to the sax, I'm not. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, fucking skunks coming here. No, <laughs> Keeping no. them K's as soft as possible. Exactly. <laughs> not, no hard K's. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Nah, but, yeah, I've lived there for like five years. Yeah. Left uni nearly two years, two, two years ago now. Yeah. And, um... It's just cheap as shit, like. It is so cheap, isn't that's it? That's why I'm still there. Yeah. He says that, like, I'm trying to buy a house. And he's, like, looking, like, so he's, shit, yeah. Man. He's, like, jealous of the, the house prices around ours. Yeah. 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 I mean, I still not got a, I fucking live with no, my wife. What is house. here more expensive than oh, yeah. Manchester's it's, dead it's expensive. Man, yeah. Yeah. Stockport, it's, it's heading it's towards, like, London prices. It is so insane, man. Mm, yeah. Like, and even Stockport's not cheap now. The place I've got in Oldham would be... I'm not. Well, I won't fucking say figures and stuff, but it'd be about sixty grand more here really? in Stockport. Fuck me. Yeah, so no. and it's like not <laughs> yeah. a better I, area. I, when I was mean? walking here, I walked past a job centre, and then the next place was a casino. Yeah, and I'm like, <laughs> yeah. Just, like, you can't, I think that's the root of the problem. <laughs> McDonald's yeah, you know? job centre casino, yeah. the right. trifecta of smackers. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's great. Poverty triangle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just give me two sacks. Go on. You're quite a short boy, aren't you? Yeah. He you said that. So happiness. You're kicking it closer to that. Wait, hang on. There we go. You've had, <laughs> you've had Adam on this podcast, so you know. <laughs> I'm just <giant. Stone. laughs> Oh, Adam Stone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're massive. Yeah. Um, Big cock, I've heard. Staunton? Yeah. No. I wouldn't be surprised, you know. No, he, no we look like he carries a cock. Yeah, the, I was, the was the listening. Uh, oh. I listened to it on the oh, way. It'll be a perspective thing, that though, won't it? Yeah, well, yeah he's like 10% of his height. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so it looks massive. That's what we yeah. were saying, wasn't it? Yeah, but that's, yeah. A, that's very impressive. <laughs> yeah. And like, he, he, he is a bigger penis than I do. <laughs> oh, I mean, really? No. No. What are we Mine's talking? Fucking oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That was just the way of staring. Uh, you came onto this pod like, how can I stare? These boys like talking cock. How yeah. can I, how can I stare? Well, this is the problem. Like, they're probably the first one to actually take it seriously. So I send a list to, um, to every guest that we have of like, uh, here's what we're going to be talking about. Here's the sort of like things we do, the features and stuff. Uh, if you want to listen to an episode prior, then I recommend these. And I, I think it's, uh, I can't remember who I list. Um, Adam Staunton's one of them. Callum Oakley's a, a good one. Um, and they're the ones that we enjoy doing the most. So they're the sort of episodes that we sort of like promote a little bit more to the future guests. He's obviously gone straight on to Adam Stoughton's and gone, fuck it, let's talk about John Cena and this. <laughs> <laughs> That's all we talked about. Um, but yeah, my cock's really big. Yeah. <laughs> Is it? Just, yeah. just to I, jump, I, just I to could jump back into that. Slap you ever from could here. you? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> you should have got him on the Patreon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. put that behind the paywall. Yeah, we've been demonetized very fast. Um, <laughs> the Irish Bull too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah could do it. Yeah, yeah. he but, knows his part. He's good at it. No, no, oh, yeah. he was on uh, Mount High, wasn't he? I know, I know the Northwest podcast scene, lad. Oh, I'm right. not yeah. I blended that. Didn't yeah. I? Yeah. Yeah. Get out of that one. Um, but yeah, Liverpool for five years. Have you like which areas of Liverpool have you lived in? I've lived in <coughs> all the like sh- sh- shit holes. Yeah, but I love them. That's why I love them. Yeah, I live there. You know, yeah. I live in Torquay. Yeah, I live in Canny. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> so no, I'm in Anfield at the moment. I lived right. in Kenny for like three years, and uh, the road I lived in in Kenny was called Albert Edward Road. But for like I think at least one year of me being there, it was Alberto Jedward Road because the graffiti just never got painted off. Amazing. It's fucking. It was. I lived in like student houses where the stu- the, the the landlord is making a fucking killing. Mm. Is, is it shit that when property. you were in a student house, you were more. Independent. Independent <laughs> than you are now. Yeah. He lives at his girl, yeah. his wife's mum and yeah, dad's not, house. Not girlfriend, wife, come on, lad. Yeah, I'm, fucking, I'm an worse. adult. It's worse. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's a living crisis. You were more right. independent <laughs> as a student. You are more of a man as a student. I'm, Ridiculous. I'm very much a man. 
Yeah. I fucking survived, Kenny. Kenny is yeah, terrifying. Yeah. I didn't really leave the house that much, yeah. to be fair. Oh, around there. Do you love it? Yeah, I really do. What is it? Just being able to... I, the thing... <laughs> Everyone chats to you, and even though it's usually <laughs> like it's You're it's a conversation. Your language, someone yeah. someone's talking to me, yeah, so I'm happy. Yeah. You know, uh, I don't want to break the bubble, but they're kind of talking at you most yeah, of the yeah. time. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they'd yeah. be making those noises whether you were there or not. Yeah. Most of my social interactions are with crackheads. Yeah, like just generally in life, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they that's confide on, the in me. <laughs> <laughs> what are the neighbors like? That's a good question, actually. What are the neighbors like? Because I have I've lived in rough. I've lived in <laughs> Tubrook, lived in Anfield, I've lived in Kenny. And in all of the above, me neighbours were all right. Mm-hmm. Like, actually dead sound. But I did always find there was, like, a moment of, like, realisation speaking to them that there was that they were racist in some kind of way. Oh, really? Like, it, just, it was like, it took a while. Like, at first, you know, it was just small really talk. Them? No, I really liked them up until that point. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they were all dead sound. Yeah. It's so awkward, yeah. that, Because, <laughs> like, my neighbours are dead sound. Um, but there is that sort of like underlying, like you don't want to become too friends with them because yeah. what if you invite them in for a drink, you're having a drink one day and you're like, oh, I've had a really tough day. And you're like, oh, why, 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 why have you had a bad day? Well, it's fucking, these Asians just won't stop coming up. And you're like, mm. ah, yeah, fuck. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you're I just, you're stuck with them then, Was that Asian accent though? Huh? Was that an Asian accent? It was a bit, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had a lovely na- neighbor who was—he was a deaf guy, so he was—he was on disability. He was always home, and whenever I'd leave the house, he'd be like out working on his car, and he was just dead chatty, dead nice, always like asking after me and that. And then, and then he just let out the bombshell of like um, how his uh, benefits were getting cut, and he blamed all the immigration. And I was like, "How do I? How do I? Re- I just kind of like I go, <laughs> yeah, yeah, which is bad. I'm enabling it. Yeah. I just can't call people out a on neighbor, that stuff. Enabling it." Ah! Ah! See, he does the puns. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, like, how do you, like... How well, do it's you... difficult to call out a deaf person, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> or maybe it could be that easy, because it's the neighbours, you're giving them a good, like... I think <laughs> that's disgusting, what yeah, you yeah, just yeah, said. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah silence him, you racist cunt. <laughs> 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 but you can't, you racist. <laughs> yeah, like... <laughs> what is racist in, like, sign language? I don't know. No, that was John Cena. You can't see yeah. me. Yeah. It? yeah, no, I, I don't know. I don't know his language. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't know why I thought you would. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> well, you, you must have to communicate with some people somehow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a pretty impenetrable accent. He's lived in accent. Liverpool five years. This is all his only <laughs> way is to yeah. communicate yeah. properly with them. He's just like <laughs> the, the, my my downstairs neighbours. Uh, they put a note under our door one time, and it was like, um, you, we, "You're stomping around late at night, and you need to stop." Like this, but it was a lot bigger than that. And I was kind of like, oh, what should I do about this? So I wrote them a letter and put it on their door. And I was just like, you know, we're not students. Um, I work late, so does my housemate. Um, you know, uh, appreciate what you've said, but honestly, just know it's not intentional. P.S. We've cancelled the marching band rehearsal tomorrow. <laughs> 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 then I gave them an email and she sent me an email back and she was like, oh, okay, that's on. Yeah, like, yeah. And she was sound about it. <laughs> but she realised we weren't students. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> that's class. Rastle. We actually, we met very recently. This is your first time meeting Daniel. It is. Yeah. Yes. And, I'm not uh, sure what I think yet. I'm yeah. <laughs> <We'll> <laughs> <see. just> <laughs> uh, I feel like it's very mutual so far. <laughs> yeah. I think uh, both sure of you trying to work each other out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He'd prefer if you were more of a crackhead and you think he's too much of a Um But we we did the roast at Hot Water together. Oh, we're didn't dead, we? Done, uh, right? Yeah, and it was fuck it. Out. It was one of my favourite nights in stand up. Oh, it was um, incredible. Then. It was it was so good, man. I don't know if the clip's not been put out yet on YouTube, has it? Not the whole uh, thing. No, I've seen just, a few clips on social they media. Posted though. quite a lot of clips, yeah. but then they've not posted the the Mayfit, which is mental because I've seen what they have posted and mental that we weren't further in the fucking not queue i guess yeah uh but fuck it out it was i i'll be honest with you i hadn't seen your stand-up beforehand and when yeah. you said you've been gigging for a year i was like this is probably going to be sad because yeah. i'd looked at the other roasts at hot water and like largely they are a lot of like sort of newer acts doing it and you are just trying to figure it out you're trying mm-hmm. to figure out how to write a joke when you're a year in mate you fucking crushed it man oh thank you, you. absolutely destroyed me and the worst part <laughs> is i nailed it I nailed it and still got obliterated, man. Yeah. This is why I wanted to get you on because I was like, I'm going to fucking kill him in my mum's spare room. I was like, <laughs> I'm going to put him in the, the ground. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why he brought up his how big his cock was. Yeah. Yeah. He got it. 
because he's the fucking getting on the yeah, table. Just want one more little yeah. flex in before we die. Let's just start the dick measuring contest <laughs> yeah, now, yeah. boys. How big's yours, Aaron? <laughs> it was so fun, man. And yeah, I, I was so nervous. Like yeah, the whole I, way. I, I didn't expect well. to be as nervous as I was. Um, it's a different environment than what you're used to, though, isn't it? Oh, you're doing new material, like basically, new material. basically thing, isn't against it? someone. But not yeah. only like new material, like new material that's like I've never done before in terms of like I've never done a roast battle before. Yeah. So I don't even know if it's my thing. I don't even know if I'm good at writing them or anything like that. So brand new material, brand new ideas, 200 people in the room and someone's ripping you. Like you, you obviously your job's to come back at me, but then you've got two judges where if you fuck up, they proved that on the night with yeah. the other battles, didn't they? That they'll just go in on you. Yeah. Um, if you if you shit at it. So you've got that in your head as well. Like this has to go well. Yeah. And if it doesn't, it is getting clipped up to thousands yeah. online. Yeah. So there's all of that. And I was literally shaking. I'm like holding my phone because I didn't read like, we had fucking like 20 jokes each, didn't we? So I didn't learn them all. And I'm holding my phone, like literally my hand's shaking. And I was like, I was like, I hope no one can see that I my was hand's shaking. Was it or could you just feel it? Because I think sometimes Sometimes you like feel a certain way, but what you project is different. But like yeah. in my yeah. mind, I was like fucking this, like genuinely like fucking <laughs> on my phone. Um, but yeah, man, it was it was so fun. But I was shitting myself, mm. and it just came over me because I wasn't before, and we were chatting before, and yeah, I was yeah. fine. And then it's like the yeah, as soon as I got on, I was like, ah, oh, fucking yeah, this is a lot. This what was but it like? Was for you? Is it your first one? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> but I think it was also just the adrenaline of it because yeah. we were doing well. Yeah, just there is that as well. Gatton was like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Have you? Know? you se- you've got to have seen that clip of him. I've seen the, all, all of the clips yeah. of you doing it. I've yeah, genuinely yeah. never seen a pop like it in a yeah. comedy club. Like it was, it was oh. ridiculous, man. So if the people that don't know, if you uh, go on mine or Daniel's Instagram, we um, there was a woman in the crowd at the roast battle, and she just kept shouting out, didn't she? Yeah. But it got to the point where even Freddie Quinn was like, "You're being annoying," and when Freddie's saying that. You know, you know, you need to wind it in. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, because yeah. his whole like mo is like, keep coming at me, and I'll keep batting you away. Well, that's the whole. And it got to point the point where even yeah. Freddie was like, "You're just insufferable. Shut up." Um. So by the time we were on in the second section, we were just like screaming, "Shut up!" At her for the entirety <laughs> of it, she was just not letting up at all. But it got to the point where like sometimes it was helping. Like he skated the uh, the podcast. Thanks for being a guest. Um, <laughs> <laughs> he said that the podcast was dead shit, and he said they opened it up to the crowd and was like, um, "Does anyone here listen to?" and she said what's that and he went exactly so that's when you're like i mean i hated her i wanted her dead in that moment but that's when she's helping because it fucking blew the roof off just that interaction but then there was other times where she's just stepping on stuff oh my god she's being a nightmare and you're like this is just never ending you need to chill and then i did a line uh i mean go and watch the clip but daniel just absolutely fucking destroys her off the back of something i said and it it was so good and i've genuinely i've not seen a reaction like that in a club before i'm gonna go out on a limb was she the type of uh, audience member that thinks that she is having a direct conversation with yeah. you two. Yeah. It wasn't than, like, yeah. oh, you're shit. It was, you talk about football. Oh, Did, I love football. Like, what about you? Know, it was like, <laughs> so insane. What are you talking yeah. what about? What do you, what do you think this is? Yeah. 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 It's <laughs> mad, isn't it? Yeah. And but, it's it's very common. Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's, she she was awful. She was an awful person. And she's since been tagged in the clip yeah, as well. She's and been not tagged responded to it. She's been tagged. One of her mates has got. Wait, is this you? And tagged it, and she's not replied to it. And it definitely is her. We've clicked it, and we can see those cheeks a mile off. Yeah, there. yeah. <laughs> um, so like, that was be, fun. To be fair, to you, she is the second best looking Tally Tubby. You know? Yeah, she was. Uh, <laughs> she was a spit of Miss Piggy. What a woman. What a woman. She was yeah. awful. I hated her. Really? No, but yeah. th- thank you for being there. <laughs> yeah, said, thank you for being there. Yeah, yeah. She's really raised his social media. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, love. <laughs> Did you enjoy it, though? Is it something you do again? Um. Oh, yeah, I'm like... like I thought about you every day for a month. Yeah. Like, 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 just clip that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> clip just that, sense, clip sense that, as well. He's obsessed. obsessed. Just yeah. constantly yeah. thinking about you. Yeah, it, it, it was hard work. I was the same. And like, I've got a friend show to write. And like, it's tough because like, it was so fun in the moment. And then I was driving home and I was sort of like, um, I rang Beth to sort of let her know how it went and stuff. And the adrenaline was wearing off. (laughs) (laughs) You wish you had a woman to wink. Uh, Call me if you want. Just sit to the smack heads outside your house. Like, (laughs) rose battle. Yeah, good. (laughs) Um, So I rang Beth and like, I was talking to her about it and telling her everything that happened. I'm like, I'm doing it with like loads of enthusiasm. And then slowly the adrenaline was wearing off. And I was like, none of this was worth it. Because you, know you start worry mm-hmm. about the implications of like how big the platform is and how like yeah how's the clip going to look all familiar in your mouth so how did you deliver shit. it like, yeah, yeah, and yeah I had anxiety for like the next day afterwards and then the clip started going out and I was like this is all right yeah. it's fine it looks like me and you versus that woman largely that wasn't a roast between yeah. us yeah. Um, but I just don't know if it was worth the stress 
like because you don't get paid to it you get like expenses and stuff but it doesn't even cover fuel and stuff yeah. really it's just it's just to do it at yeah. hot water and that's the um what's the word i'm looking for that's the the incentive yeah the incentive you just get to go on hot water's platform and stuff yeah um but it just it's so, so, like you say so much work man like I, I, um, I wrote with one of my friends, and it was just her and I. Not staring. me. Tried to write with me. You, you've already said. Like I'd love to go against you in a roast battle. I think it'd be the easiest dub of the of the century. Yeah, like it's me. just not your yeah, your style at all. Yeah. Um, but I, I was, I went on Facetime to one of my friends, and we started like trying to write a few things, and I was sort of saying like, oh, he says he's from this place, and we were trying to make links to stuff, yeah, yeah, yeah. and it was just her and I staring at each other on Facetime for an hour, and yeah. nothing coming out. You like you just it does it There's just takes up no so material. much brain space. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is it. I don't <laughs> like to, I'm like, go on. It, <laughs> I didn't want to go for just like what you like because it's boring in it yeah. and then also i'm quite glad i didn't because freddie and fucking will just oh took God. everything right at the start <laughs> it, like i just stood there and took it yeah yeah it's all I, you can I, do I, it, I, it, it was, was like, a bit annoying to be honest i was like, like I'll, I'll stand there and take it and just not say anything yeah. because then people are going to feel bad for me yeah. yeah and then they want me to do well then yeah yeah and that must have been tough because you're in like a 1v1 situation and then uh, instantly your status is dropping as you're being like yeah 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 like sort of broken down before the yeah. battles but i knew that was gonna happen like like before i went on i was like i don't know if i said you i was like oh i should have shaved and i was like nah to be honest that would make zero fucking difference <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> what of this can i yeah, control yeah. <laughs> the first thing that freddie said he was i just went wow <laughs> <laughs> I just looked down. I was like, "Go this, on, yeah. man." You know? It was a bit annoying from my perspective, though, because straight away they started going in on what you look like, and obviously we didn't know each other prior, so all that we have to go off is the information you've given me and what the other person looks like. But all of them jokes have just been done by the. So like, so much of what I had planned just got stepped on right away. Yeah. And I actually said to Freddie, "I was like, you've just taken everything I've got." Because yeah. he was like, said that he looks like a sex offender and uh, and, and a victim, and I was like, "Well, that's that one gone." Um, when you do him. <laughs> yeah. um, uh, you're gay, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that was literally the entire yeah, battle. I yeah. would have like these, like, like what I like to think were like cleverly crafted, like bits and jokes, and I was he would like, just Alan go. Sucks dick. <laughs> With some glee as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the way you, he said he had that, he had that like staring session with his mate over Zoom trying to write jokes and you were just like gold, gold, yeah. gold in one 10 minutes. I love that. He thought about me every day for a month and the best he come up with was that he's a Margaret Thatcher loving gay boy. That's the only thing that- <laughs> and, he, and a fish. Yeah, and a fish. Yeah, he yeah. felt like a fish. I was like, you look like a fish, bro. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing it no justice whatsoever, are we? Oh you were so offended you left out a fish. <laughs> it was so funny. He spent a minute saying that I look like a, a but ugly fish with like bug eyes or something, and then finished it off with, but I would write to look like you rather than me, though. <laughs> <laughs> it was like every every line we had against each other, we just complimented each other afterwards. It was yeah. so yeah. stupid. It sounds um, like you had the good approach about it, though, because a lot of people, it is like, obviously, it's you, you two versus each other, but from the clips I've seen and the way that you have talked about it, it sounds like it felt like it was you versus them in a way yeah it was than... we were a team we yeah were a team this well, is what i, wouldn't I, have, always... I wouldn't have thought to approach a roast battle like that mm. i probably would have been like it's the first thing freddie says and it's so bang on because i bet if you asked everybody in the crowd that night without showing them a picture of us because people will go off like what they were um like seeing us would like yeah. jog their memory but if you went did daniel mccrina win or aaron mccrina rather did, or aaron win They'd go, and you'd, go, fucking, and you'd uh, go Randall from Monsters Inc. or Harry Potter. Which yeah, one yeah. won? Yeah. Um, <laughs> but if you said to him which one, <laughs> yeah, look at you taking notes. <laughs> Round two. Um, <laughs> but if you said to him, did Daniel or Aaron win? They'd go, uh, Daniel, Aaron, Aaron, Daniel, Daniel, Aaron. And they wouldn't know. So yeah. it, it doesn't, but all, what they would remember is that they had a good time. Yeah. And that's what Frey said. It's a collaborative thing. And you watch some of these, like, um, these roasts on YouTube, and they're like, they're just getting, like, fuming about it. Yeah. And they're, like, angry. So it's like, no one was laughing harder at anything you said than me. Yeah. Because that's how you've got to be. Yeah. Like, I just, I yeah. think it's so cardio when, like, oh, I've given you this information where my mum's disabled. Have at it. Do what you will. Oh, your mum's your mum's disabled, and like you can't say that. It, it just yeah. seems so stupid that yeah. you've signed up to this and you're surprised you're being insulted. It's mm -hmm. so stupid. Both um, me and Aaron have disabled mums. <clears throat> oh yeah, it's something we bond over. It is. Get the notebook out. <laughs> <laughs> you're <nagged. laughs> Your mum's got a blue badge. <laughs> That was our quiz name. Hey, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, that is a full quiz name. Yeah. Yeah. Um, 
Love yeah, it was uh, it was so fun, man. I I really enjoyed it, but I had, I'm like you. I don't know if it was worth the stress of yeah. like. No, I'm everything. I'm fucking glad. And I was like worried it's, it's that done you would really pull well out for me every day. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Like every day, you, like, you'd you have just to change because like fucking, I book a gig, man. I've had to replace three people in the last twenty four hours, yeah. mm. and then the previous gig was like four people in the last fucking four days before yeah. it. And so everyone pulls out of gigs all the time, especially when they're not very well paid. So. Yeah, I was just like, I'm writing all this. It might be for nothing. Yeah. And that's why I kept sort of checking in with you. How's it going? You still writing? Are you going for it? Uh, you're still definitely I, not going to pull out. I message. I was like, are you ready for the... I hope you're ready for the roast battle. <laughs> <laughs> he, he was like, yeah, I'm ready. Yeah, yeah. After that, yeah I think I'll be all right. Now. Yeah. Yeah. I was like straight on that. I was like, Hannah, get on FaceTime <laughs> now. <laughs> <laughs> just in relation to like the, the sort of... Uh, the, the way... You've, we've just talked about you taking the jokes yeah. on a on a roast battle. Have you ever had a gig where you've not reacted well to something that's happened in the crowd? And you look back and you're like, oh, fuck, why did I respond like that? Um, Maybe a wee bit. I mean... <laughs> I mean, talk about putting him on the spot with the most niche closed Very question ever. No, no. That's there's, cool. There's, <laughs> I did a gig in Southport and there was this woman and she was just talking the whole time and I was hungover. And I, I wasn't, like, gleeful with my rebuttals. Yeah. It was just yeah. grim. I was like, fucking just turn your hairnet off, you know? <laughs> fucking. I thought you said turn your hairnet off. <laughs> <laughs> just said, like, oh, you have no teeth and, uh, you know, your, your pants are full of cobwebs, you know? But aggressively. And, yeah, but really aggressively. And people weren't vibing with it at all. Yeah, yeah. I was like... <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Yeah, <laughs> and it's like, no, nah, that's just not the way to approach yeah. it at all. It's yeah. odd, and it? I've had like one that springs to mind. It was a Hughes gig in Crosby, and a guy like heckled at one point, and I, I put him down. It was fine. Moved on. Heckled again. Put him down. Moved on, and then he heckled a third time, and I just kind of like, I, I, I've, I'm not an aggressive person. I don't think. But I just had this wave over me of like, I want to fight him. Yeah. yeah. And, 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 and I, you would lose. And I couldn't hide it. And I was like, I couldn't get off him. I was fixated on him then. And he was, was just so, on, he mounted him. He just couldn't get off. <laughs> <laughs> and it was like, everyone else got super awkward because yeah. I was quite clearly being very aggressive between me and him. And my wife was in the crowd. All right. And after oh. it, we, I had another gig. So I was driving from there to do, do a Mike Osborne's gig in Birkenhead. And uh, I got Humble brag. Yeah, I'm just saying, you know, connections in it. Oh, yeah. Ten minute spot on pay. <laughs> yeah. like Sunday night, you know, yeah. business, business. <laughs> Little double up on the open yeah. mics. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I, um, I, you know, I, 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 I got out with my wife, and she's, I'm fuming. I don't say a word to her. She's like, just, you know, seems like she's monitoring the situation. We get in the car, close the door, and she goes, "I think that you just needed to not focus on him." And I was like, babe, just shut the fuck up, uh, please. I just said, shut the fuck up and don't talk to me, please. Yeah. <laughs> like, it politely. But I, like, I was like, I'm, I'm well aware of that. I appreciate you trying to help, but just don't. So we just sat in silence the whole way to Birkenhead. Get to Birkenhead. I had a smasher. I come off stage. Off stage. <laughs> it was a pub. Came off the floor. <laughs> came off the floor, yeah. <laughs> Got decked. <laughs> yeah. um, it came off and, and like they, it went dead well. And Rebecca was like, uh, oh, do you feel good now? And I was like, no. I still just felt still that. Hate him. Yeah. yeah, the whole time you know you, I'm turned on. Whoa, whoa wrong whoa. Uh, choice of word. Nice. Yeah. I'm t you know you turn it on for the second gig, and and but inside I was just like rage. Mm. Do I do some features? I can do. Yeah, sure. do some Why features? not? <laughs> <laughs> just before we go any further, though, I just wanted to bring up the fact that um, in that clip from the roast battle of that woman, the one that looks like Miss Piggy, and she's been tagged in it and stuff. Um, I forgot until like the day after, but she got up in Daniel's face. Mm. Did I tell you about this? No. It's so funny. Gig. In that like, the second round, he does nothing but slag off me for like doing jujitsu and stuff like that. He's like, oh, you would just want to roll around with men because he's gay. Um, <laughs> it's great stuff. It's, 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 it's fucking highbrow stuff, man. You know? Um, and then she sta when he says that to her, um, and the, like the crowd fucking goes crazy. Is she stands up and gets in his face, and I was like, I'm so that would have been a turn up for the books, in it. Round two, you're skating me for it, and round five, I choke her out. Yeah. Like, I really wanted that to happen. Go to sleep. Yeah, yeah. go to sleep. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh man, could you? Would is that assault? Like if I de if I defend you, yes, yes. like she's coming yes. at you, yes. and I yeah. defend. And I Ooh, that's a that's. I think that is assault. But if you defended yourself, I don't know if it I is. I thought she was just coming to give me a wee kiss. I would have given her a wee smooch. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah. I would have smooched her. It's it creepy as fuck when you do, do it like that. Do you, you want to give me a wee smooch? I would have I puckered up, you know? 
<laughs> I hope you mean your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what features have you got, Liam? <laughs> so I've got some not so fine of things, some finer things, some Reddit posts. Dealer's choice. What do you want to do first? Uh, we'll go finer things. So they're quick, them, aren't they? Yeah, so. you want to do some finer things? Yeah. Have you got any, first of all? Have you got any finer things? Well, we'll listen if you're now yeah. my twig something. Sound. Yeah. So we've had a few sent in since we've been asking for it. Um, so I've got one here that's. Weirdly, says, we didn't get anything sent in before we asked. No. No, like before the feature existed, nobody sent anything in. Oh, no. Fucking moron. None of the fans? Yeah. Hold on. He, he went, this is the roast battle between me and you, lads. <laughs> You've seen how I react. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Let's have it. Since we've asked, we've had people being sent. It doesn't matter. Carry on. I can't be asked. Carry on. It's called presenting. Trying yeah, to present. You're presenting. Oh, all right, okay. You're, doing a, you're doing a really good Thanks, job. Thanks, yeah. <laughs> This is what you fucking... <laughs> <laughs> so Dan Harper says, when you're forced to make weekend plans with a friend that you didn't want to make in the first place but felt obliged to out of friendship, but the friend cancels those plans last minute, leaving you free to do what you really want after a busy weekend, after a busy week, which is fuck all. Mm. I think that is the yeah. best. Yeah, yeah. I find that as I'm getting older and older... I'm getting fucking locked into so many plans, like with extended sort of like social circle, family, um, you know, work, and just if something is cancelled, it is just fucking Mr. Popular over here. You heard this? Yeah, I am. Got loads of mates, me, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He yeah. has got loads of mates, and it's mental because if you've met him, I don't know how he's managed to keep them. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's I'm likable. You, you seem nice. You seem nice to me. <laughs> Thanks. You wouldn't like. <laughs> You won't move shit around to hang out of him, though, would you? Well, I don't know. Would would I? I'll move your would. shit around. <laughs> I don't know much going on. No. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm the same. Yeah. That's why I do this to him. I've got, like, I've got quite an empty calendar, largely. Hey, don't you two be roasting me now, all right? Fucking don't turn this no, around. No, I'm not saying it, but I don't understand. Like, you're saying like you've got, you're so busy that you're buzzing when people can't. I just, yeah. I'm sad when Could, people cancel. Are you messing? I've I can't remember the last time I was I've been sad trying to meet up with Tegan for four months. Really? Oh man, it's ridiculous. It's so, but like, she's not doing it to like cut me off. We're really good friends, but like, being an adult is just so fucking annoying. I, oh, I don't know. Oh, you should, know. We, should we meet up for for some food? Yeah, I've got June twelfth free. What? What are you yeah. on about? <laughs> no, I'm not. What I are you on about? The calendar out? No, because that's that's it. When you get to a certain age, you've got to get the calendar out. Yeah, no, I'm fine with that. Fucking... But it's in three fucking months, and then do you know what's worse? She'll go, oh, I've got June twelfth free. Let's do that, and I'll go, fucking, oh, I'm busy. How's July eleventh? You're like, this is just never, you're never going to see any friends. Yeah. I didn't have friends when I was a kid. I was bullied. Thanks for bringing that up, Daniel. But like, <laughs> now I'm older and I have friends. I can't I fucking have time to see them. Yeah. It's great, isn't it? No. I like my friends. <laughs> Why'd you get bullied? Huh? Why'd you get bullied? Oh, I'm fucking really autistic. I was always a new kid. We moved around a lot. I had weird eyes. Weird yeah. forehead as well. You should see it. Yeah, I, had a, I have a very big forehead. Yeah, I, d- I didn't notice. It's because you won't. That, that fr- that's not a haircut. It's an optical illusion. That's what that is. <laughs> I think. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, all right. I no, think no. I have quite a decent wee hair. Yeah, yeah, you've got a decent hairline. You know, it's, it's pretty it's, solid. Oh, you've got yeah. Yeah. for you. <laughs> 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 I'll cling on to what I have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you got to take life's wins. Yeah, we'll Finer do. things. Your hairline. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. Finer things. That's true. Everything. There we go. There we go. Everything else is yeah. a fucking disaster. <laughs> I've got uh, Do you want to do a not so fine a thing? Uh, can do, yeah. Whatever yeah. you've got. So Tom Jenkins says, when you desperately need to shit on a night out, not only is it embarrassing <laughs> if any of your friends find out, it's also disgusting trying to choose a toilet clean enough to sit down on. None of them are. I've None of them are. Thankfully, never been in that position. Oh, I wow. couldn't imagine anything worse. I do not give a fuck. Do you just... I, You've I'm got ulcerative ser- colitis. Yeah. yeah. I, Serial so, By the way, I've met him twice. It's so weird how much I know about him. Because <laughs> yeah, you've had to. Yeah. Like him most yeah. And I didn't even bother going for it. Because yeah. I was like, oh, he just sits himself. Should, yeah, yeah, yeah. The worst part is, if I said... That would have killed, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's a gay shit house. No. <laughs> Who no wonder you shed so much getting bummed? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You should write his Wikipedia with yeah, all that it. you know about him. Oh, man. So uh, you don't care, though? Or is that just oh, no, 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 no. Like, I'll shit anywhere. But you've, is that because you've had to? No. <laughs> I don't even need to go sometimes. He's just... done it twice since he's been here. Yeah. So on a night out, like, oh, out drinking? Yeah. Do you hover? No. No cheeks to the porcelain? Yeah. Oh, I couldn't. It knocks me sick just looking at some of those oh, toilets. Nice. It, 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 like a Like a... Cold, cold ring on your arse. <laughs> yeah, but it's not the cold, the fact it's a cold ring, it's the fact it's a wet ring because people mm. have pissed all over it. Yeah. 
But you know, you live and you live. Live by the sword, <laughs> die by the sword, don't you? Yeah. A question: If you go Auntie to a, if you go for a piss in a pub mm-hmm. toilet or a bar, bar toilet, a nightclub toilet, and there's piss all over the seat, do you? I said, Don. <laughs> I was just gonna say, do you lift the seat up, <laughs> or do you just become part of the problem? Do you clean it before you sit down? Oh no. What? I just sit there. Some sometimes I. <laughs> Check, make sure the temperature's yeah, just yeah, I don't know yeah, if I yeah. want him on that chair anymore. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah no, I, do, I, no, I get what you're saying. I, uh, first, what? No, not you. Are him. You no, no. Yeah, fair enough. No. Fair enough. <laughs> this, guy, this guy. I love eating piss. Yeah. <laughs> it's a safe space. Uh, yeah. You don't eat piss, you drink it. You piss, are you chewing? Fucking eat piss. Yes. Oh, God. Yeah. Um, but no, I understand what you're saying. I also just hate shitting in public in general. Like when I'm you sat there and it. the fucking light goes off and you're like doing mm. this behind the fucking and then you've got to wait for somebody to walk in so you can wipe your ass but then you've got to wait for them to leave so you can flush so they yeah. don't see that because the, they'll put two and two together I have so much go, I have such anxiety of this because they'll walk in the light will go on they can't then hear me yeah because they'll know that I was in there but the light was off so they'll know that I'm taking a massive shit yeah mm. and that, you've been they there say, for a while. such main character syndrome like I think they give a fuck they don't but in my mind it's so oh it's awful have you ever been in one where the flush is automated and just the <clears> way you're leaning to wipe your ass keeps setting off the flush yeah but that's like just a repeatedly Japanese going off seat. and you're like fuck like it's just it's the sound Shit it's just doing your yeah yeah, yeah yeah like people are thinking has he fucking blocked that bug and I'm that's like that's the no. working class b day that's what that is <laughs> little poverty the b little day splashbacks there. are helping along the way yeah, I am. Um, I, one of my most uh, humiliating shits was uh, when I was in Florida. I was in the Starbucks toilet and I'd been to Hooters the night before <coughs> and had like spicy oh, chicken wings. Yeah, I was with my wife. Oh, wow. Uh, it's not like that. It's, it was a classy family establishment. <laughs> he went for the chicken <laughs> wings. It was a classy yeah. family establishment. You don't understand. I went for the burger and fries, <laughs> not did, the tits. I did. I the tits are a byproduct that tri- I'll happily look at. Yeah, good yeah. reviews on TripAdvisor. And um, yeah, I was just shitting out these wings and um, some American guy came in and, and I was just, I couldn't hold it. And it was like, you know, fart city dead loud. And he went, dude, what have you eaten? <laughs> and I just kept quiet, like still, like Jurassic Park. But like, he was in just, the cubicle next to yeah. I, I think he was just walking in. I think he just pissed in a urinal, but it was just like, dude. Like called me out through the fucking yeah. I'm still cringing thinking about it. Oh, th- th- he's American. Yeah. <laughs> At the end of the day, you know. Well, should I just responded. It'd Chicken be wings. so funny if you got like dead aggressive with him, like you did to the heckler. <laughs> just like, what have you eaten? What schools did you show up? Like, <laughs> fuck off! Yeah, like, what have you eaten? Your mum's ass. Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> just going like so heavy on him. <laughs> yeah. And Beck's like, ah, are you okay? Do you need? Honestly, I think you handled that a little bit, right? You like shut the fuck up, babe. Is she in the toilet with me? Maybe, you know, <laughs> yeah. You care? Well, one of my mates told me. Um, he took a a pill on a, In a, cre- a cream fields actually, so it's less uh, exotic wow. than that song. He took a pill at cream fields, and he um, like apparently uh, you need to shit if you take ecstasy. Okay, and he was like, "I'm gonna shit." That's why the bogs in festivals are supposedly minging, and he like was queuing for the toilet like desperate, like mm. it's gonna square out, it's gonna square out. He's the next one at the door. He, he opens the door to walk into the porta party, just shits his pants everywhere. Can't go back to his friends. He's he's only there for a day, so he's not got a change of clothes or nothing. He's like, I've got to get home. Um, and he lives in Wigan. So he's like, I'm going to go get a taxi. And he just goes to a taxi driver. Does like taxis parked outside. And he's like, full disclosure, I've shit my pants. Can you take me home? No. Of course, why would he say Goes that? to the next taxi. Um, full disclosure, I've shit my pants. Can you take me home? No. Goes to the third one. Full disclosure, I've shit my pants. Can you take me home? And they go, 200 quid. And he goes, deal. So he says, um, <laughs> flash forward to him getting driven home on the motorway, sat next to this taxi driver. Sat next to him. That's <laughs> what yeah, I get said. In the back. That's what I said. You're he didn't lying. have the decency to get You're in the back. You're lying. Mate, the taxi driver apparently was on the motorway with his head out the window going, <laughs> 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 Well, that's what I said when he that told me insane. I went. That is insane. I'd have put him in the boot. Yeah. And he what said, are you talking about? He said he's just going the whole time. Sorry, mate. Just oh. <laughs> dead like Loki. That is insane. Is he just took a pill. He must have been wild. The taxi wild. driver's head out the window like a dog and he's just sat there like no pecs on. <laughs> Jesus that is awful. Yeah, that's insane, isn't it? He sat next to him. That is insane. <laughs> I don't sit next to him with, now, without a shit in my no, pants. No, if it's, mm. um, okay, if it's a full taxi, I do. But if it's just me, yeah, you get in the back, don't you? Aye. Yeah. Yeah, wh- where are you sitting in the, in the taxi? Um, you don't sit behind Not the driver, directly behind yeah, because they'll have their seat out for the yeah. comfort. You know what I mean? I sit on his knee. 
Do you? <laughs> Anything to get that fucking free ride, bro. <laughs> I don't just mean the taxi. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you drove that taxi. <laughs> yeah. like you made. I, yeah, I, I right? said, he put I his said, gear stick was somewhere. <laughs> I sit directly behind him. Yeah. And then just whisper <laughs> things. <laughs> and he's kind of like, what? But I'm like... <laughs> hold the way you're holding like, that steering what? wheel. What did you say? <laughs> <laughs> what? What? You got out here? <laughs> I'm saying that. This is like every ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> so I actually harassed taxi driver. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. This is this insensitive for me to ask you as right an up. ulcerative colitis sufferer? Mm -hmm. What's the Maddest shit you've ever had. Um, Come on, he's got loads to choose from. Yeah, he does. <laughs> like before, because I've had to get loads of colonoscopies. Yeah, same. And, yeah, uh, respect. Yeah. And uh, what a weird thing to put <laughs> <laughs> Shitty hands. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. They, they, I, I they, told the story of mine. Literally, when it went up, I went, "I'm gonna shit." <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They yeah. put like, um, you know, uh, what even is it? I don't know. Like a big. It's basically it looks like a big crayon. He just fucking shove it up your ass and then, and he fell your ass and then. Oh no! I never had this. No, it was, it was great. <laughs> no, they they fill they fill you up with, with a dye with like shit. Oh no, not with shit. They're trying <laughs> to put shit, shit in out. you. Yeah, they they fill it up and then it makes you flush everything out before you go oh, in so for you've your had a deep like. Yeah. So like yeah. that's a that's an intense experience on yeah. the toilet, but um. When I went and got my colonoscopy, it was great because, you know, they give you drugs, great. first of all. <laughs> and um, that's always a bonus. And then the guy who was um, put me under, he was, well, no, I was still conscious, but, you know, administering the stuff. He was, We were just chatting about it and he said he'd been to the theater recently and he was like, oh, I saw the woman in black. And I was like, oh, sick, you know. And he was like, I probably shouldn't be talking to you about this before. It, like, it's a bit scary or whatever. And I was like, I don't mind. And as he's putting the mask on me, he goes, here comes the woman in black. And he put it on. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, ha, ha, ha. Oh. Uh, Would have been mad if the last thing you saw was a Jamaican nurse come in and you're like, did he just fucking say that? <laughs> Does he being real? Oh, Jesus. My, my nurse was Jamaican for my call. <laughs> but we, she it, comes in like, tip. <laughs> well, it was wonderful because you got to watch the camera on the screen in front of me, so I got yep. to see inside my ass. Yeah. yeah, but it was just like watching a wee game or something because you were so high. <coughs> so just watching it all go around, he was like, "Okay, all, all good." And watching then Pac Man, he's just collecting the little nuggets. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what it was like. <laughs> but he was like, "Oh, you didn't prep properly for it," and I was like, "Mate, I've been in hospital for two fucking weeks, and I just had a big crayon up my arse. Like, what more could I do?" <laughs> You know, I've been <laughs> shitting on the toilet for about three hours, mate. Come on. Like, I didn't do anything. Yeah. And he was like, I thought you'd be used to that because you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> you're right, he is. He is yeah. fun. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's just silly, isn't it? Yeah, it's just fun. You big fish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that one actually hurt. Did you have, um, did you have any uh, outtakes? How do you mean? From the roast, did you have any outtakes that you didn't use? And oh, you? yeah, loads. There was, I, I think I wrote about 30 different things. Uh, oh, I'll right. let you have a look at some of them, because like, just <sighs> throwing shit at a wall, which is yeah. like used to. Oh, do, uh, we, do one now? <laughs> huh? Do you want now? Oh, is that too much pressure? Because right, so, they're right, just not going right. to be... And, like, if I didn't use them, it was for a reason. There was right, a few yeah, that I didn't yeah, use because yeah. Freddie had said them. Yeah. Um, but yeah, just uh, you just you I just kept writing, kept writing, and then just picked my favourite ones. Yeah. Mm. Um, but yeah, nothing beats you a Down syndrome fish. Um. <laughs> That's it. I mean, I mean, come on. No, I, I was going to say that you look like the sort of guy who gets an erect penis in the bath, pokes his head just out of it, and then goes, Oh, it's a Loch Ness monster. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't know how that would fly, you know? Yeah. But. I mean,. Accurate. How did you know? Yeah. <laughs> How did you collate all this information on it? <laughs> I actually was so broke that the bath we have is so small and I am quite large of a human mm -hmm. and it's just out anyway. It's that shallow, I'd have a Loch Ness monster in yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> would be poking out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a Loch Ness form. <laughs> um, yeah, I, yeah, there was a few. There was a few that um, that didn't make the cut, but yeah, there's, I can't remember. Yeah. Been mad. I'll let you have a read of them later. Um, um, 
Oh, time we do. Let's uh, let's wrap this up. If you're new to the podcast that you're watching, because Daniel's on the facts, we appreciate. We do a section at the end called Off Your Chest. We invite the guest or a listener or anyone, some, someone, anyone to get something off their chest. So, Daniel, have you got anything you want to get off your chest? Well, the, the one thing I always felt bad about this, believe it or not, I used to be a bit of a bully. Fuck off. Yeah. What were yeah. they got the kids like? Yeah, in school. yeah, could you imagine? You know? No, but that's what I'm kind of like, you're, it's kind of embarrassing I bullied you. Yeah. But um, <laughs> there was... there was I've been there, to be fair. What, one time, um, I, I was sent to, like, our head of year, and I knew it was because, you know, someone's reporting me for bullying or whatever, and I was like, oh, okay, it's this guy, right? So I went in, and he was like, you know what, I've brought you here, Daniel. And I was like, yeah, not going to say his name, but I've been calling such and such. I've Gay? Been call- I've, been, I've been calling him rat face. That's what, and he was like, no, that's not why I brought you here at all. Why did you say-? And I was like, oh, God. You uh, snitched yourself yeah. up. Yeah, I, I was actually calling a guy fat. So ah, that's the... I know. So you just told you, on yourself completely. Yeah. You just wanted that You've got to deny, deny that deny face. Yeah. You've got to deny, deny the whole way through life. Denied, denied, so you believe it yourself. I guess. No, I'd, I, I'd, I would have been honest like that. Mm. Yeah. You, I, I, I used to like, when I'd get in shit with teachers, I'd always just kind of get away with it. Mm. I think, you know, I've got so many friends and I'm so likable, mm. as, as I was saying before. No, I would just like, one of my mates That's would why literally get. Do a roast battle because he's so fucking blind to his reality. <laughs> I'm so like, he doesn't want to be told the truth by anyone. Yeah. <laughs> no, but it's a nice thing to come up against if you're just like, oh, I did, nice guy, you yeah. know? Like, I, I would never roast you because I like you. I don't believe... I feel like that was a roast in and of itself. I feel like you just inadvertently told me you don't like me. No, I do. I'm paranoid now. <laughs> That's the best way to roast him. Just keep being really Maybe. nice to yeah. him. <laughs> <laughs> Until I snap and ruin what, what little Just the whole time, I just compliment him while looking him up and down and side-eyeing. And it's like, oh, could you imagine? Like that's your life. Like somebody, somebody in your like. There's a really good way of like making people feel uncomfortable is if you just look at their forehead while you're talking to them, and they just they can't it, they can't handle it. They're wondering why. You, I've yeah. never noticed. Are you, are you, I can see that you're doing it yeah. to me now, but if anything, it, it just makes you look like you've got a bog eye. So I feel pretty calm about it. I do. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Everyone, you just enhance them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I thought one of my mates had a tick when I met him. He used to just literally go like, um, I'd be talking to him, and he'd just go like. Mid conversation, <laughs> and I'd be weird. like, "This fucking guy, what's going on?" And then I'd been friends with him for months. We used to sit next to each other in this class, and he was always just like that. Mid conversation, it turned out he was just mirroring me because I do it to lift my glasses up my face, go like that. Oh, you're but, so weird. So he was taking a piss, and he was taking. Like he was year? just, for, and I was just. That is That's a long con. A lot, but I thought this guy's weird, and I'm doing it all the time. Not even thinking about it because it's just a tick. Look, that is so look, funny. Look. Up, mate. Yeah, man, you look great. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Well, you don't realise what you do. You get it a lot. Um, I don't know if you've had it when you're on stage. Somebody will point out something that you do. Yeah. And I used to like touch my face constantly while I was on stage. Nothing was itchy, yeah. but like I didn't notice it until somebody... I remember I was... Um, I was doing a gig and I had like a run of shows with the same people. And on like the third show, I was setting up my camera. And um, it was, it was uh, someone walked past and went, oh, you're setting up your camera to record your set? And I said, yeah, yeah, I always do it. And she's like, well, when you watch it back, uh, just count how many times you touch your face and just walked away. And I don't do it now. Down, yeah. But like, you need someone to let you know. Harry Stacchini had the same thing because um, I was telling him about it. And uh, every time he would do a joke or speak to someone in the crowd, he got that. Well, like, not <laughs> that like, long. So like, when you see him do it now, you're yeah. like, you stop it. And he had to like rein it in because you yeah. just go, Noticed like, it. like some sort of like Churchill dog and yeah so what he's saying is bullying is good now like you called that kid rat face he'll stop being rat faced rat faced <laughs> no but uh, I think I was the rat face in the whole thing you were projecting yeah, yeah. definitely <laughs> it's like, who the this. fuck am I to call uh, someone a rat I, I face was, look this is why I'm not built for roast battle that was my first thought yeah. and I didn't <laughs> want to say it because you probably just because you felt me yeah yeah I didn't want to be mean for the yeah. sake of being mean yeah, yeah. yeah. I yeah. called him a gremlin <laughs> As soon as he like said I was like, ugly, I was like, fuck off, you little gremlin. Like, <laughs> Did you get away with it then? The teacher was like, fuck off. No, you didn't. No, I know. I got in trouble. Like, I deserved it. It's good you've had the self-reflection <laughs> now, though. You've grown as a person. Yeah. You're a better person for it. Yeah. Yeah. No, I just bully you. Yeah. <laughs>
could it take was it. great. You know, it was like I was by. It was a childhood memory. Yeah, you know, got, <laughs> it was like you were training. Relive, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, relive, uh, when you see past. like UFC fighters finally achieve their goal of becoming champion, it cuts to like home footage of them <laughs> at like fourteen, still just like train. That's just you. You're just gonna cut to school footage of you just being like, "Where you little gay rat face? <laughs> <laughs> you fucking fish." <laughs> Jesus Christ. They've called people fish for years. So, so <laughs> stupid. Um, mm. I'm very homophobic. You really should fucking f- think on. I know it's lucky I'm gay. Yeah. I've I forgot that. about that this whole time. I've been, oh. I've been <laughs> oh, we've lost. The, even the camera's like, I'm out. I'm not getting involved. I'm not getting involved in that. Like that. that one. You literally just saved yourself at the yeah. end. Yeah. <laughs> uh, fuck, we've lost the, we've lost the wide it's shot. all right. Address that one and then Daniel can like scooch in with you. Oh yeah, come oh, close. Yeah. Come close. Yeah. This, is, this is my plan all along. This is just go. the round. Bring up. this. So bring the mic with you, then. Okay. Right. It's, yeah. We're only going to wrap it up anyway. You're going to do your plugs and there stuff. Can I sit on your knee? Um, that costs extra. Uh, no, of course. <laughs> oh, careful. Okay. Costs extra. Um, suggests he's paid to be on here. <laughs> so that's Daniel. Look, we're sharing a wide shot. No, I, I, well, it's not the wide, but we've got. <laughs> Um, you smell like you've shit yourself. Um, <laughs> <laughs> don't fucking touch me. Um, <laughs> oh, this is sexual tension. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's sad. It? <laughs> Just it's right after you've told me you're gay, you've got to get real close. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you were the one who invited me yeah. over. <laughs> I think you're fine. Yeah, yeah. stop it. Um, <laughs> have you got anything you'd like to plug other than my ass? Um, <laughs> You mic, also need mic, the mic, you uh, fucking my, sausage. My Instagram is Daniel McCraner. Yeah. And watch out, I've got a show coming out called In Bed with Daniel McCraner. So uh, keep your eyes peeled for that. <laughs> I'll be there probably. <laughs> 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 you boys can come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> with Liam's the cock in the corner. <laughs> I'll watch. Just watching. Yeah. Um, sick. So Daniel McCraner on Instagram. How are you spelling McCraner? Because M-C-C-R-E-A-N-O-R. Sick, good stuff. That was like and, proper uh, spell and be style yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. McCraner. <laughs> you said a sentence. <laughs> Daniel McCraner wants to fuck Aaron. Um, yeah, no. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. You could do better. Could I? I think so. Oh, That's nice of you. But men will fuck anything, won't they? Yeah. 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 I, do, I do much better with men than a yeah. woman. Well, Big yeah, I'm fucking know. surprised. Yeah, though. you could have. <laughs> <laughs> um, but definitely get on Daniel's Instagram. The clips from the roast battle are on there. They're really worth a watch. There's a Miss Piggy there, and she fucking has a hard time of it. Um, but they're really worth a watch. Get on his Instagram. He's class. You've only been gigging it for about a year, haven't you? Yeah. And you're already crushing it. So uh, definitely give him a little follow. Have you got anything else you'd like to say? Thank you and good night. Lovely Aww. stuff. I mean, we're not done. Are we not? No, he's got to give us three things that he hates. Oh, uh, give us three things that you hate, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I hate empires. Good. Um, ice cream vans in the winter. <laughs> Very different. And Aaron saying no to me. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus 